All right. All right. So NHL stuff that we have to cover. So uh, when obviously way. you've got to be pretty happy. Um, wait, how was Pittsburgh sitting in their series with the Islanders? Uh, they dropped game five last night. So they so so down, down three two. two. Okay. So right. who who all is finally or officially moved on? So Boston. Yeah, you know, we've got Boston. Did they, did um, they sweep? Or did they drop again? Um, they know the only sweeps are on the um, the left side. That was I would say the um. So they drop one game over. Okay, the kind of, which is kind of surprising to me a little bit. Like I feel like the Capitals would have taken this a lot longer of a series. The Capitals were what the number one team out of it? No, no, I think Pittsburgh won their division. Yeah, Pittsburgh won it. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, probably, Washington was number two. The Bruins beat them as the number three seed, so a little bit of an upset there. Not really. That's, um, yeah, it's like saying a yeah, uh, eight nine seed in like basketball. Yeah. Yeah. It, was the, it, was, it was the Hurricanes, Pittsburgh, the Avalanche, and then Toronto Maple Leafs. Am I right about that? Yeah. As the yeah. one seeds. Yeah, yeah. Those, yeah. Were the, those were the one seeds in the divisional winner. So, um, well, obviously, thanks to everybody that was watching our uh, our. Hockey NHL uh, playoff predictions video. Uh, got a bit of a blunder, but yeah, we, we did blunder a little bit. Yeah, we uh we said something wrong about the year. Uh, Toronto and Pittsburgh got swelled. No, we said it was both of them. Tampa, I thought it was Tampa. Was it Tampa? Yeah, Tampa Bay Lightning. Yeah. yeah, so we made a little blunder. What year those two teams got swept? But so the sad part is <laughs> we corrected ourselves, but that part got edited out of the video because. Adam over here was like wandering around the room and no. doing other things. He was not being a professional. No, he was not being a professional. It wasn't a good look to have Adam wandering around as we like were correcting ourselves. But we ended up being a right. It was not the video. But I appreciate you guys on YouTube that were correcting us and letting us know. It's yeah. good to see the engagement. And we appreciate your comments too because I actually have written a couple things down and um, you know wanted to kind of go over those as well because I actually. Uh, I reached out to a person, and uh, I'm trying to think about who it was. It was uh, the the handle was quack quack seven, and he he I mean he gave me the full spread. He was like, all right, here's my four. His four were Carolina, the like the final four, Carolina, Montreal, Boston, and Colorado. So those were his final four. He said Boston and Montreal in uh, in the finals in the finals. And then uh, Boston winning it, and I wrote it back. And, and this is all fair game for anybody that wants to take the challenge as well. I wrote it back. I was like, "Yo, man, listen. If you hit this perfectly, I'll send you some some swag. We'll send you a koozie. We'll send you a couple stickers for free on us. You yeah. Know, if you hit, if you hit this thing perfectly, we'll we'll take the gamble on it. So, um, you know, we you know we appreciate the comments. Uh, you know, Taylor came in and said the Panthers are going to win. Uh, somebody from somebody that was a Maple Leafs fan, uh, or. Yeah, as a Maple Leafs fan, Kevin was like, "Nah, man, there's no chance that the Panthers win. You're out your mind." So, uh, did he? Did is he like every other Leafs fan? They're like, "Yeah, this is our year," but they lose in round one. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Is Toronto even? Uh, I, I haven't kept up with it enough. Did they? No, is that them advancing right now? No, yeah. that's that's one of them. It's one of them. Okay, Toronto is up. I believe. Oh, game. Carolina. No, they're playing. Uh, no. Toronto is playing on um, Montreal. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, and Toronto's up 2-1, so we saw, yeah. Those games are probably actually happening right now, if not over. So, yeah, we can actually, update that. One play that's I say it, yeah. So. But, surprise, um, team that I thought, I thought was doing better. Toronto's up 3 nothing at the end of the second in intermission right now. So, okay. so, so it looks like they're probably. poised to go up 3-1 in the series. Okay, right. Yeah, and then the play, uh, the play, President Hurricanes are tied 1-0 at the end of the first right that, now. That series has been a lot closer series than I thought it was going to be. And it's been yeah, because Carolina was looking hot, dude. Oh yeah, they were, they were but it's been fun. Cooking. It's been fun to watch with Zach. But as at the same fan. yes, but at the same time, it has also been aggravating. Why? Um, because one minute you know he's up here, but then as soon it's like as soon as they score a goal, as soon as something bad, it, his whole demeanor changes, <laughs> and it's like. Fuck these guys, we fucking suck. Blah, blah, yeah. blah, blah. <laughs> so he's a sports fan. <laughs> yes, but. Who uh? I mean, who had the who had the clean sweep out of the three that are already advancing? Uh, Colorado, Colorado both, both teams come out the left. You had uh, Winnipeg get the sweep, the sweep, and Colorado got the sweep. Wow! Which surprised me about Winnipeg because I 
I said in my last video, I liked Edmund, the oh, Oilers, yeah. to be one of like the sleeper teams. Homeboys just go and get swept in the first round. Didn't one of them go to like three overtimes out of the four games, though? Scroll, uh, scroll down. I, think, I actually think that's what it is. No, it's the Capitals and Bruins. No, keep going. Keep going. Look at, look at one of the sweeps. I can scroll. I, I know that. I was telling you. There you go. It is. Yeah, it's the yeah, four. Three, yeah, three of the four. All, yeah, three of the four get overtime. That sucks, dude. Yeah. Just to, just you're right, you're right there. And you got swept into Hell, overtime. Game, for game two of Edmund, Edmonton and Winnipeg was one nothing in overtime. Yeah, that's, wow. a, that's yeah. a game. Wow. I that's guess. a game right there where you're literally just like on the edge of your seat the entire time. You're just like, each something goal, is going to happen. Each goal we probably had 40 saves. Yeah. yeah. The heartbreak in Edmonton right now. I feel, I feel for you guys. I do. I feel bad for you. That, that's what about the stuff. Boston series? I mean, they had three overtimes, but I mean, Boston ended up winning. Okay. Okay. I mean, hey. Boston give, won two out of three in overtime, then won the other. Got to give credit to them. We, yeah. had a, we had one more submission as far as uh, peaking yeah. in the final yeah. four. Yeah, uh, three overtime. Uh, Mr. English, who did correct us on uh, Tampa Bay. Again, we apologize for that. The video got cut. Uh, he has Carolina, Toronto, Colorado, and Pittsburgh. He's got his head again. He's got uh, Carolina, Toronto, yep. uh, Colorado, and Pittsburgh. Okay. Well, Colorado's the only one that's been on in the next round so far. That is okay. four. Because they have the sweep. They have got the clean sweep. Toronto um, is. Uh, the yeah. Okay. They're, they're playing. Man, I'm telling you, the left side of that bracket is strong. Go, go ahead. You've got the two sweeps. You've got Tampa over there. Just not Tampa. you got Toronto over there. Duking it out with the Canadian halves right now. In Vegas, too. In Vegas in the wild. Yeah. I Vegas is Vegas is going to get that. Um, you think Vegas is going to beat uh, Avalanche? No, Vegas is going to definitely move past the wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they're, you think they're going to uh, beat the Avalanche in the second round, though? I mean, that's got to be the matchup of the whole playoffs, though. That there is going to be the, one of the matchups. I think Toronto and Winnipeg now is also going to be one that everybody's going to be really All excited right, for. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, they were the Vegas was one game away from you know a five game series. But yeah, they, they dropped the they dropped game five last night. Yeah, um, and the t whoever's going to come out the west and the north, man, it's going to be for tough. Wild, <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a tough that tough that matchup. championship game. There is going to be insane to go to the finals. As um, a as a Pittsburgh fan, like, like now now that I've seen that Boston beat Washington. I think if we get past the Islanders, we will beat the Bruins. And then okay. we'll most likely have to face – shit, I was going to say the Hurricanes, but I don't know. Nashville's putting up a hell of a fight. Yeah, Nashville is – They're not riding they're, off into the, to the sunset. But you kind of hit on that, didn't you, Like as far as like, experience? Because I feel like Nashville's – I did say that. I was like, Carolina was looking hot, but they just don't have the playoff experience, which – it's a huge thing in the NHL. They yeah. don't have that. They don't have that many veterans on the team that can, you know, coach the guys through it and stuff like that and rally the team up. But I can't remember who but the Pittsburgh I, fan was, but we had a Pittsburgh fan comment on the video and, and said that the only team that he sees that Pittsburgh may struggle with the entire play, like he was calling Stanley Cup if you make it past this team, and it was Boston. So, really? Yeah. So he, I mean, great prediction by him. He thought like, I don't Boston know, was like beat Washington and. Here we like are. you're saying, well, that, Boston did give us trouble during the regular season. But like you were saying, the, the left side of that bracket being Toronto, Winnipeg, Colorado, Vegas, whoever you know, those that left side of that bracket is stout. That's yeah. a, that's a, <laughs> that ain't no slump competition over there. I, I really, I'm calling it now. It, it, you know, as we're you know making videos every week, I don't know how fast it'll get to the series, but I think that Avalanche Vegas series will go six or seven games, and it will be a heck of a series. Okay, I can believe that. I believe I mean, that. It, it may be, it may be better than the whole Stanley Cup ends up being. But shoot, right now, I mean, so we've lost. Let me count the total games. Y'all continue going on. I'll say, you know, the, the I say, on Pittsburgh versus Boston. Like I said, this this Carolina Predators series has been a, a solid uh, back and forth. As far as you'll have, like, the Canes will go at one nothing, but then the Preds will come back 1-1, 2-1, 2-2, one, one, two, one, two, two, you know. It's not like you're seeing a, a quick 2-1 or 
2-0, 3-0 jump, and then, you know, the other teams having to struggle to get back. It's great power, well, it's great power plays, um, just good puck movement, and, you know, so it's it's a lot of back and forth, back and forth as far as scoring, scoring goals here. I mean, I'm just like, I, and I'm not, let me be, from a personal standpoint, like, I'm not the biggest hockey fan, but oh, I, I feel I like... I think we could agree that Alex is definitely the biggest yeah, hockey yeah, fan. Yeah, certainly he's the biggest us. hockey fan of all of us. But I do believe that, like, playoff hockey is some of the most exciting sport, like, in just in sports in general. Like, yeah. I, I, would, I would probably personally rather, and, and I treat these both pretty much the same, NBA and NHL. I would rather watch an NHL game in the playoffs Instead than an of NBA one. playoff game. Right, I, agree. I feel like there's more excitement in that, especially in the early rounds of both of them. Like in the early rounds, there's good even matchups across the NHL. Some of these first round matchups in the NBA, I mean, this is going to be a four-one series. Yeah. The Pittsburgh Boston record when you look at the Pittsburgh side of it for the regular season was three, four, and one, without one being over time loss. So okay, that's fair. But so the Bruins and Penguins were pretty much evenly matched in the regular season. So I. I, I do agree with that, guys. Yeah. This I think we'll get past the Bruins, but that's going to take some work. But like do you, you think that's going to be like a seven-game series? I think that'll be seven games. Um, if, they get get past the, if they get past the Bruins, I think we can take out whoever comes out okay. of Carolina, Nashville, or Florida, Tampa. If the uh, if Pittsburgh, Carolina are meeting up, you trying to end up uh, play a hockey game in Raleigh? Yeah, I'll do that. Okay. And you can go yeah. and you can go try the melon patch. What is it again? Yeah. Nah, no, yeah. They they might get another chance. We'll see. <laughs> All right. We'll so see. I think so. I'm gonna revise mine a little bit. I think uh, I think Winnipeg will move on to the third round. They'll they'll win where they get out of Toronto, Can uh, Canada, or Montreal, I should say. Um, Vegas. I just think they will beat the Avalanche um, right in the back of Mark andre Fleury. Then okay. you've got Vegas and Winnipeg. Winnipeg beats them, goes to the finals. And I say Pittsburgh comes out the other side. Nah, it's going to be biased. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so going to be Pittsburgh versus, <laughs> Pittsburgh versus Winnipeg. Um, in, the, in the Stanley Cup. Finals. In the finals. I think Pity will win that one. I just don't think I don't think Winnipeg has enough experience so, to be in a high level caliber game. So like Pittsburgh in the finals. If Pittsburgh doesn't get out the first round, roast this man. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely yeah. roast this. I'll outfit. take it. I'll take it. So I can, I'll, I'll, I'll take. Only a few teams I'll listen to talk shit about Pittsburgh. So yeah, that's um, fair. I'll 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 say Toronto's getting past Montreal and then also past Winnipeg. Yeah. So into the third round. Easily accomplishable there. That's yeah. Very good. Um, give me. I do. I do like Vegas beating the Wild, but I think the Avalanche will win that one. So you got Toronto and the Avalanche facing yeah. off here in the finals. Yeah, and then give me. Give me uh, Toronto again to the finals. I think that's what I said in my post predictions as well. Um, and then. I think I originally had the Capitals in that. Coming out of the uh, top of that bracket with the Pittsburgh and them, I believe you did. Yeah. But uh, now, no, I know what I said. No, I said I didn't want to take any of those three. And I was going to take uh, the Islanders. That's what it was because I didn't like any three. I didn't like any, any of those teams. Uh, but give me uh, give me Pittsburgh coming out of that section. I, I, I'd rather see Pittsburgh than Boston. So you think Pittsburgh's going to come from the right side yeah. all the way? Um, you think Pittsburgh going to the finals that you're saying? No, give me. I think the Canes end up pulling it out over the Preds, and then I'm going to go with just the speed of how how Carolina plays. They got a lot of speed, a lot of young guys. Uh, take them to the finals, and I wouldn't mind seeing the Canes win it all. That'd be wild. I want to check where this series is. I wouldn't mind seeing the Canes win. You know, local team. Clo yeah, Canes, the closest. Yeah, team to it, closest yeah. team to us by far. All right, I want I want to check where where this uh, series was standing before I made this hot take. So. Uh, I'm going to take Toronto, Vegas, Pittsburgh, and Tampa Bay. 
that's my four. Okay. I think Tampa comes out of the bottom right, and uh, I don't really know a whole lot, of course, about the teams in the top left, even even their past experience. But um, I feel like everybody, including some of our fans, are really you know talking Toronto up. I personally think the Avalanche could beat Vegas. I think uh, I've already said that that it's going to be very serious. Like, like all four of those teams out of the top left, are Canadian. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Edmonton, yeah. Toronto. Yeah. 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 So yeah. how many? There's what five teams out of Canada, right? Or is there six? Six, like the Flames and yeah. Calgary Flames and Vancouver. And um, you got Ottawa. Oh, okay. So seven. seven. Yeah. Yeah. Seven. All right. <laughs> Either way, seven, over half the Canadian teams made playoffs this year. Good. Good. They haven't won a championship in like. I don't want to be wrong. Was it the nineties? Didn't we look it up? I feel like it was the nineties. Yeah. yeah, we looked it up last year. So, anyways, t- you know, Tampa, Pittsburgh, uh, Toronto, and Vegas, and I think it's gonna be Vegas, Pittsburgh in the finals. So, I'll, I'll take Vegas in the championship. I don't want to be different to you. So, uh, but you know, that again, great start to the playoffs, and it's been some, exciting. And it really has some, some really good teams. Of- so. A lot of overtime games. Tell us, tell us what you think about our predictions. Yeah, uh, talk to us, let us know, comment. Yeah, and, and please. Some of, and some of you have made some pretty good predictions, and they're all still currently sitting around. So we'll see. And please roast him if Pittsburgh does not make it. And out please roast him. Yeah, bring, <laughs> it. Yeah. bring it. So, um, but thanks always for the support for the NHL. We really appreciate it. We always have fun talking about it. But um, any final comments for? No, I'm good with that. Yeah, uh, fly penguins, fly. I know they can't fly, but. They can fly on the ice. Okay. I think that's Close enough. Close enough. It works in the video. How about slide? <laughs>